what's up guys um hold on I'm trying to pick a song here um I want to give you guys an update real quick for everybody who has seen the video of me calling that asylum um, this is an update from that for anybody who has not seen it yet go watch that video and then you would understand this video um, there they are now uh, Ever since I made that video, now today is the 17th, that scared the shit out of me. Today is the 17th of April. I made that video at the beginning of the week. Like, roughly, I want to say Monday, Tuesday-ish, I think. Either Sunday, Monday, or Tuesday, I can't remember. I, I made the call one of those three days. And then I, I tried to edit the video the best I could. Obviously, I'm not very good at it, but, you know, practice makes perfect, whatever. You know, I'm, I'm just starting out on, on video editing. But I made that video, or I, I made that call, and I edited a video, and... Again, I'm not very good. It took me a little while, and on top of that, my computer is not the greatest. You know, so it was a little bit slower. But anyways, it updated, or it uploaded. Ever since the night that I made that call, I have been hearing more and more taps around the house, more and more footsteps around the house. Um. Uh. I, 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 I keep hearing what sounds like a woman giggling. The other night we were sitting in bed. Well, I was sitting in bed. She was asleep. I didn't know this. And I heard... I was watching TV and I was actually messing around with the video. The same video that I'm talking about. And I heard what it sounded like a woman talking like directly in my ear. I thought it was her. So I looked over and I'm like, you know, what's up? You know, what'd you say? And she gets pissed off for me waking her up. I didn't know she was asleep. I thought she was talking to me. So obviously it wasn't her talking to me. And <clears throat> I, I rewound the video that I was watching. And I watched... I watched it again. I rewound it for a good 10 minutes. And I watched it. And there was no sound of a woman talking. No sound of a woman giggling. No sound of a woman, period. Um, there wasn't even a woman on the TV. And... Uh... Excuse me, so that freaked me out a little bit, you know, and I, I told her about it. Uh, but that's not even a big thing. I've been seeing, now most of the time it's out the corner, you know, the corner, your peripheral vision, uh, out the side of your eyes. I've been seeing this, and it's not the same shadow Thing that I've seen since I was a kid. It's not the same thing. But I've been seeing actually a couple different shadows. Um, now, again, they're out the corner of my eyes, so I can't really uh, I can't really make out, you know, if they're actually shadows, if they're you know, uh, full out entities uh you know if they're if it's a male or female 
All I see is a shadow, something solid out the corner of my eyes. And I go to look, and it's gone. Uh, and this has happened probably a half a dozen times already since I've made that call. So I don't know if anybody, like, I don't know if anybody else is having the problem who has called that number. You know, I don't know if, because uh, again, I got this idea off a of, uh, off a of mic uh, that uh, 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 what shall we do next? You know that channel. I got the idea off of him. I don't know if he's having the same problem because he made. I believe he made the video about two weeks ago. Or made his video about two weeks ago. I I don't know if he's having, you know, weird things happen to him or not. Obviously, I don't talk to him. You know, we're not buddies. We're not, you know, I just, I follow him on Facebook. Or, uh, yeah, Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube. But, I, again, I, like, I'm having... Some weird shit, and on uh, on top of that, the other day, um, uh, I'm sitting on the bed, and this is broad daylight. I'm sitting on the bed, or no, no, I'm sorry, it's not broad daylight. My fiance just got home from work. This was not last night, the night before. She just got home from work, and. I'm sitting on the bed. She walks back in the bedroom. And she closes the bedroom door. And I'll actually show you. Uh, the bedroom door, whenever you close it, it stays closed. Wherever you stop the door at, it stays. The other day, she closed the bedroom door. And we usually keep it cracked about that much for the cat. For, actually, for the cat and the dog. To go in and out just in case the dog wants something to drink or the cat needs to go to the bathroom or wants something to drink or eat, whatever. The door literally opened completely back up. And it immediately caught my attention because it doesn't do that. And I looked at her. She's talking to me. I'm looking at her, but I keep glancing at the door. And finally, I look back at her like, you know... Like, looking at the door, like, hey, do, do you see that? And she looks at me, and she goes, I, I seen that. I, that caught my attention. That's a little bit weird. So this is exactly what it did. Let me walk my fat ass back to the bedroom. This is what it did. <coughs> oh, excuse me. This is what it's supposed to do. Okay. And usually there's nothing there, nothing stopping it, whatever. So that this is what it's supposed to do. She literally shut it like so. Now you open it, it stays open. You stop it, it stay uh, right there. It kind of opens up a little bit, but then it stops right there. Okay. She shut it, I uh, say about right to there. Now notice how it stays shut. This door literally opened at this speed, like real slow, like somebody was holding on to it the entire time until it can't went fully open. And again, we looked at each other like... Like, I, I looked at it, and I watched it, and I kept looking at her, and I kept glancing at the door. Looking at her, glancing at the door, because it freaked me out, man. It freaked me out because it doesn't do that. I don't normally get freaked out by stuff, especially like that, but <clears throat> unless it, unless it's out of the ordinary. If it's out of the ordinary... Yeah, it's going to freak me out a little bit. And 
I even got up and I tried to mess with it. I tried, I tried, you know, getting it to do that again. I couldn't. I, I just, I, I couldn't. So, and again, everybody's always telling me or asking me, you know, what if it's this? What if it's that? What if it's that? What, you know, guys, I am a maintenance guy. Okay. I was a maintenance guy for 10 years. On top of that, I'm a sensitive. And, and like, I, I, I'm a sensitive and I'm a realist. Okay. It's kind of hard to be all the same, you know, those two at the same time. But since I am a sensitive, I have to always kind of prove it. Okay. Like, Considering I know that there's shit out there per from personal experiences, you have to prove shit to me face to face. Like I have to see shit, you know, uh, see shit face to face in order to know that it's real. Hence the reason why I bought the mirror. But, you know, again, I tried debunking. The door, I I couldn't, I just, I couldn't figure it out. I can't, I can't, I still to this day, this is a couple days ago, I still to this day can't figure out why the hell it did that. Um, and again, like, like I was saying, like, you know, uh, uh, like I'm a realist. I have to try to figure out something, you know, a reason behind something, you know, uh, like, uh, kind of like what a skeptic would do like and I couldn't figure it out <laughs> it's weird so yeah I just wanted to give an update um let you guys know that there has been some weird shit going on since I called this number um and I mean it, it it could have nothing to do with that number. I mean, we uh, we went to this to that cemetery a couple, you know, last week. It could have something to do with that. It could also have something to do with, you know, uh, me playing with that with the Necrophonic app or the other uh, apps that I, you know, spirit apps that I have. Uh, it could be something else coming through the mirror, you know, who knows, but all I know is that's what I've been, been seeing. And usually I'm going to have to turn my camera on my, my, uh, my, you know, digital handheld camera, because usually whenever something weird happens, I get like a really weird, like sick almost feeling um like lightheaded and all that stuff and that usually happens before something you know before something happens or before i see something or, or whatever and i'm starting to actually feel that way right now um so i'm at, so i'm gonna go uh because i don't want to you know start being dizzy and, and sick and all that shit on on camera so um, uh, I will keep updating you guys, so I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.